On August 15, 2023, during the Army 2023 International Military Technical Forum held in the Moscow region, Dmitry Shugov, the head of the Russian Federal Service for Military Technical Cooperation, announced that the delivery of S-400 air defense systems and the corresponding equipment to India will proceed as scheduled. He stated that the production of the S-400 Triumph anti-aircraft missile systems is progressing as planned and that the delivery of equipment for the S-400 Triumph system is expected to be completed within the agreed timeframe. In October 2018, India signed an agreement to acquire five squadrons of S-400 Triumph air defense missiles from Russia. The third squadron is expected to be deployed either in Punjab or Rajasthan to counter potential attacks from Pakistan, as reported by the Indian website News 18. The first squadron of S-400 missiles, designated as SA-21 Growler in NATO code, was received in December 2021, followed by the second one in April 2022. These two squadrons have been strategically deployed to safeguard borders and provide air defense against China and Pakistan, according to News 18. The Ladakh sector along the sensitive Chicken's Neck Corridor in West Bengal and the entire northeastern region have been monitored by the first two squadrons, as reported by ANI. The third squadron is expected to be deployed either in Punjab or Rajasthan to counter potential attacks from Pakistan. India has already operationalized its first two squadrons of missile systems. The India-Russia S-400 agreement has garnered significant attention and controversy due to its potential impact on India's relationship with the United States. The US has threatened to impose sanctions on India if it proceeds with the purchase, citing concerns about India's defense ties with Russia and the potential for Russian technology to be used against US forces. India has maintained that the S-400 agreement is crucial for its national security and that it is not bound by U.S. sanctions as it is not a signatory to the Countering America's Adversaries through Sanctions Act Katsa. India has also argued for its right to diversify defense acquisitions and maintain strategic autonomy. The S-400 is a highly advanced air defense system capable of shooting down enemy aircraft, missiles, and drones at distances of up to 400 kilometers. The system can track multiple targets and engage up to 80 targets simultaneously.